What are some tips that you wish you would have had when you were setting up your home mine? Location is key. Who's living in your house? You know, where are you going to play? Where are you, where are you going to actually place these things? And then the, the big one I think is, is, is heat as well is what are you going to do with this extra heat? I think in the winter months, it's, you can get really creative with it. And I have, I've used it to heat my basement for years. Um, but in the summer months, it's a force to be reckoned with. You know, I picked up a, a what's minor, the M21S and decided just to set it up in the basement and, you know, we'll see how it kind of goes. And I, I did that in July and, <laughs> And it must have been 89 degrees down there. It was it was smoking. So, you know, my wife's like, this is not going to work. It sounds like an airplane's taking off. The other two are bad enough. Figure it out. And that's when, you know, I start cutting holes in the side of my house. So you got to have somebody that's that's on board with you because probably two weeks ago, you know, I roll over in bed and I can't find my wife. And I'm like, what in the hell? You know, I walk out, leave our bedroom and she's on the back deck. And I'm like, what are you doing? She's like, I, I swore I heard a tornado siren. And I'm like, what are you talking about? She goes, come in that. And we came in the house and it was the miners, the hum of the miners. She was freaked out. And, and that's what's led me kind of last two weeks, stuffing a bunch of soundproofing foam all over this room that's in a far corner of my house in the basement, you know, probably a hundred and some feet away from my bedroom. I mean, it, you know, I think the technical stuff around electricity and, you know, the panel and your average Joe, when you're telling them, hey, you're going to take a four inch hole saw, bust it through your house, you're going to cut through a floor joist, maybe you can notch it out with this much room and you're going to be fine. And then, uh, yeah, so just take that 10 gauge wire. You want to pop open your, I mean, no, no, no. And I, and I really recommend get a qualified electrician to come in and and put the receptacles where you need them so you don't kill yourself or burn your house down. I mean, you know, that's just kind of where I'm at. But I, I think location, location, location. What are you gonna do with the noise and what are you gonna do with the heat? And who else are you gonna bother with this? Cause I'll, I don't care how loud it is, I'll deal with it. But you know, we have people over and they're like, what is happening in the back? And I'm like, well, let me come tell you. <laughs>